The daily grind of modern life can leave anybody feeling stressed and eager for an escape. Sometimes a weekend in a small scenic town is just the breather we need. Well, there's a little mountain town in Polk County that calls itself the friendliest town in the South. As Brian Mims shows us, Tryon might be small, but the menu of things to do is anything but. Tryon is such a little town, population less than 2,000, land area less than two square miles, yet its smallness is what makes it so great. Unless your senses are dull, it's hard to drive along Trade Street without yielding to the urge to stop and look and taste and breathe. It's an artsy town, a bookish town, an outdoorsy town. It's a foothills town that snuggles right up to the Blue Ridge Mountains. Here's the real beauty of Tryon. You won't feel overwhelmed by so much to take in. You won't be jockeying for a parking spot or jostling among crowds. Like while it's small, there's, there's always plenty to do. Go ahead, shuffle on into the bookshelf where you can browse books by local authors and books of local interest. And around here, interest in horses, what with all the equestrian farms, is in full gait. Judy Lanier has been a local here herself since 1993. She'd had her fill of Florida. But I went to several other places and this, this had me. And I do like the mountains, but I also just like the quiet. Um, it's, a, it's a sweet, quiet little town, but it's also a very active little town. For a small town, Tryon has some Tony restaurants with wonderful wine lists, like the Lavender Bistro. It has laid back southern themed dining, like the Huckleberry Restaurant, where you can drink in the sun at its outdoor tables. A popular thing to do in Tryon is to do what I'm doing right now, walk the streets. There's even a historic downtown walking tour with info about historic houses and places to stay and art. A lot of art. Tryon abounds in art galleries and art shops. Step inside the Tryon Fine Arts Center. The place exudes the sophistication of an urban art museum with its gallery of modernistic pieces and auditorium awaiting the next dance ensemble or Broadway performer or concert. Across the street is the Melrose Inn, a bed and breakfast brimming with artwork collected over a quarter of a century. Uh, but I'm thrilled. I've done a 25 year dream in about five and a half, six years. It feels good, it feels great. Marilyn Doheny, a masterful maker of quilts, moved to Tryon from Seattle in 2009, buying what was then an abandoned house threatened to be torn down for a parking lot. I said, I'm gonna bring you back to life. There was nothing in this building when I bought it except red dining room chairs. Now, this house, this grand old house with 19 bedrooms and 26 bathrooms is in full flower. I offer a gourmet three-course breakfast anytime you'd like. I'm pet friendly and I have complimentary beer and wine 24 hours a day. A playful little town, Tryon. The very symbol of town is a wooden horse standing guard along Trade Street. It represents the famous handcrafted miniature horse on wheels designed by the Tryon toy makers and wood carvers. Their history goes back to 1915 when two women bought a cottage to teach boys and girls how to make top-notch wooden toys. The toy house is now a private residence. From playthings to plays, that artistic vibe has long flowed through this town with the vigor of a mountain stream. Mayor Alan Peoples says the first splash came when actor and playwright William Gillette, charmed by the scenery, built a home here in 1891. Tryon, too, is known as a place where the mountains make their first splash for interstate travelers arriving from South Carolina. Drive a little ways outside town and you can take a short hike to Pearson's Falls. Here is the real beauty of Tryon. You can walk in the woods or wander among works of art. When it comes to a small town, Tryon is a masterpiece. For North Carolina Weekends, I'm Brian Mims. Tryon is only about 45 minutes southeast of Asheville and an hour and a half west of Charlotte. You can get more information on things to do in Tryon by calling the Carolina Foothills Chamber of Commerce at 828-859-6236 or check them out online at explore.tryon.com.